Oh, I can. Welcome everyone. Hello. Thank you for joining me. Thank you for joining us. We are going to wait just one more moment. If you are not on mute currently, please go ahead and place yourselves on mute. And I'll be right back. One more moment. Hello, hello, and welcome once more. Just a quick reminder to please put yourselves on mute if you are not already. I know some of you are still trying to connect the server here. Okay, while we're waiting for the servers to connect, go ahead and get yourselves nice and comfortable, settle in, start to become aware of where your body meets the cushion that you're sitting in or laying on. Thank you for being here. Thank you for helping raise consciousness, instill peace and counteract egoic behavior. May we be surrounded by the white light of protection. Anything that is from the most high may enter and remain. And anything that is not from the most high, I command and demand that you leave immediately so that you too can grow. May we all have an open heart and mind. May our egos be swept aside to receive this blessing and to have courage to take action, especially in all areas of resistance. We have a couple more joining. Let's go ahead and begin to pay attention to your breathing. Just notice it, don't try to change it, just notice. And again, feel where your body meets the chair or the bed. Relax your shoulders, relax your jaw. Place the tip of your tongue on the roof of your mouth immediately behind your two front teeth. And take a nice big inhale through your nose and exhale through your nose. Inhale through your nose and exhale through your nose. And if, that, if you haven't already, go ahead and close your eyes. I'm going to go ahead and begin a count or breathing to a count of seven. I'd like you to remember when you're inhaling, please look up to your third eye, right in between your eyebrows. So take a nice deep breath in and exhale everything you got and we'll begin. Inhale. 
Inhale, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Take a nice deep breath in through your nose. Inhale. Exhale. And we have a couple of you joining. Please remember to go ahead and place yourselves on mute. Now we're gonna breathe in that count to seven. So take a nice deep breath in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Hold. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Take a nice deep breath in through your nose, look up to your eyebrows, hold it, hold it, hold it, and release through your nose. One more time, inhale, look up to your eyebrows, your third eye, inhale, inhale, inhale. Hold and release. We're gonna do a count to seven again, two more times. Take a nice deep breath in through your nose, look up to your eyebrows, three, four, five, six, seven, hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and release, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One more time, inhale, look up to your eyebrows, inhale, three, four, five, six, seven, hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and release, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, nice deep breath in and exhale. Father in heaven, thank you for taking me to new levels. I know you have equipped me with a spirit of power, love, and of sound mind. Fill me with your confidence and assurance to embrace everything you have for me. Amen. So we had a common theme this week with everyone's requests. And those, the theme has been patience, confidence, and freedom. So we're going to go ahead into our prayer requests, our declaration and visualization of our prayer requests. And this is where we will also be focusing on the wins that you've all been having. When we give praise for something that we already have, and when we give praise for something that we are looking for or feel that we need or would like, they're really the same thing in the present moment. And so I've combined the wins and our requests in the same format. The most important piece today is not only declaring it and requesting it from God, your higher power, but it's you guys really feeling it, seeing it, tasting it, hearing it, smelling it, and declaring it all together with us. So after I state each sentence, request, declaration, I'm gonna just pause for a moment and whatever that looks like for you, whatever that sentence request looks like for you, feel it, see it, taste it, hear it, smell it. Let's conjure it together. So we had someone whose daughters made the Trinity vol volleyball team. We're giving praise and thanks and we're requesting more of the same. We ask that Lynn finds a job where she can thrive.
we're asking that Gail and Riley remain in good health. For Carlene and Michelle, continued healing. That Allison is safe and comforted as she travels. For our good health. We declare and give praise and thanks for our physical, emotional, spiritual, and mental healing. For our emotional and academic growth. For better time management. Respecting and trusting the process. Consistent follow through in the things that we must accomplish. For the perfect clients at the perfect time for the perfect pay. For a speedy recovery for Michelle to go home to Iowa. For weight release. The beauty of a reset. Perseverance. For being brave and asking questions. Finding temperance and equanimity when stressed. Imagining the best case scenario consistently instead of imagining the worst case scenario. Continued clarity, self-assurance. The ability to see the good in all situations and focus on the positive. To have confidence and communicate clearly in our careers and personal lives. For family to come together and support one another. To heal from leaving an abusive relationship. To find a room to rent on the water and to be close to family. to focus on goals and for successful business startup. Physical healing. Gratitude for our friends. Strength in making healthy choices for our bodies and our minds. Choosing self-care as the priority. for financial abundance, to block negative energy and distractions, to release all worry and to believe that all is well, for unconditional patience, balance and energy, to do our best. Fully self-acceptance and self-expression to speak our truth with courage, no matter what. To end comparison. Opportunities to generate multiple streams of income. For all those that we love, all those that love us, and for all of us, be blessed with God's favor. 
that all leaders and humanity seek and find the truth in all situations and act accordingly. That all leaders and humanity operate from a sound mind and a pure heart. To choose to see ourselves with Christ's eyes. For perfect spiritual, physical, emotional, and mental health. All human, animal, and plant biological systems be in supreme working order. For humanity to experience heaven on earth and in their hearts. to maximize our potential, to experience peace, love, unity, and respect consistently, for a perfect intimate relationship with ourselves and our higher power, to drop all judgment toward others and ourselves, Supreme focused energy and attention. That humans remain most important over technology. That our hearts remain soft. To cultivate and keep gratitude for everything. The good, the bad, and the ugly. to exercise discipline, to be excellent stewards of finances and all areas of our lives, to know our worth, choose faith over fear every time, consistently, no matter what. to believe that no weapon forged against us will ever prosper. For our freedom, that we forever trust our higher power, the most high, no matter what. That we have unshakable confidence and patience consistently, no matter what. that we protect our peace no matter what, that we have compassion for all, including ourselves, that we seek and practice forgiveness consistently no matter what. Many of you requested prayers for patience this week, and I wanna just take a moment to talk about the magic of movies and television. We see things happen within a blink of an eye, within a half an hour's episode or an hour's episode or even a mini series. And we go about our lives thinking that whatever project, whatever thing that we're doing, whatever, whatever it is that we are working on should happen immediately. For us, we, we are hard on ourselves. And the only magic that things take place in a very quick time happens in television, not in real life. So may we remember that there is a process to everything and to trust the process and to choose patience. Father, most high, we live in a culture that wants everything and wants it yesterday. Help us break free from this of way of living. Help us be counterculture and counterintuitive. Today, we ask you to replace our restlessness with patience, contentment, and peace. We release whatever we're feeling impatient about into your hands and trust that your timing is perfect. 
we turn away from selfish striving to embrace simply abiding in you. And we're gonna just focus on two sent one sentence here, and we're gonna say it about 10 times just to put us in a perfect stream of consciousness and energy before we leave our call today. And that sentence is, I choose patience and confidence. You can say it in your mind's eye, you can say it out loud as long as you're on mute. I choose patience and confidence. 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 One more time. I choose patience and confidence. Be blessed, everybody. Thank you and have an amazing week. Remember to listen to this frequently to help you remain in the state of mind, the state of being. Be blessed.